Hey, hey, what's what going on? What are you doing? You scared me. <laughs> you ready? Yeah. Let me close this down. We got Tommy coming down. He has got a, um, he needs some headlight restoration help. So let's head out there. He should be here uh, any minute. So let's do it. Hey, reminder, I got the garage today. Tommy's yeah, coming down. We're going to do Tommy some headlight stuff. Okay. So, all right. Door. Okay, let's do it. All right, I'll see you in a minute. Okay, bye. All right. So you got the paint dialed. Uh, the headlights is kind of what you wanted some help with today. They're pretty beat up. We can definitely help you out. Uh, yeah, you know, the headlights were just one of those things where I just really wasn't confident enough to kind of do it myself. I didn't have the uh, the right sandpapers and things like that. Right. You know, maybe some of the uh, various techniques that are involved in it. Well, before we get going, let's go into the training room. Let's check it out. So we got a few to choose from. I think today you could get away with like our two-step, which you actually don't even have to use the drill but um, since we're trying to go for the best results and they are about 10 years old um, and they're pretty yellow, we're gonna go in the heavy duty. So awesome. let's get to it. We always wanna make sure we're working on a clean working area. We don't want any dust or anything like that to get into our whole process. We're gonna tape the lights off so we don't bump into the paint at all. So we got our hand pad. Um, this is for the uh, coating. It's actually a wipe-on coating. Okay, opposed to a spray uh, on. Opposed to a spray. And then Plastex, wool pad, and then this is our two sanding disc, and then we got our drill. So that's it. We got our thousand grit. We're gonna sand vertically in straight line. And basically what we're going for is just we want an even, clouded appearance. So we got the thousand grit step done. Go ahead and take the three thousand grit disc. Do that the same way, just horizontally. So. These are looking really good. This is a wool pad attachment for a, a regular drill. This is our Plastex uh, clear plastic cleaner and polish. All it takes, just a little bit of Plastex on the face of this wool pad. The corridor of our shoulder, kind of start it out slow so the product can get spread it out. And then turn up your speed a little bit more once it's, it's spread. But once you get it spread out, go ahead and turn the speed up quite a bit. And that's what's really gonna help clean and remove the, the sanding marks. Oh. Yeah. Just like using a, a dual action polisher, it just takes a little bit of getting used to. We did both sanding steps, the 1000 grit, 3000, and, and buffed the light out with the Plastex. Now we're going to do a quick pass with some glass cleaner, and then we'll put our wipe on coating for the final step. All right, Tommy, so as far as the wipe on coating goes, the way that we're gonna apply this, we're gonna put it onto just an edge of this uh, foam pad here, and then we'll kind of just do straight line overlapping motions. This will actually just self dry. Is this a product that you definitely don't want to get on your paint? Um, I mean, if it were to get on there and dry, it, it's not gonna hurt anything. It's just would be uh, a little bit challenging to get off. You would just probably need a little cleaner wax to get it off, but that's about perfect the way you're applying that now. So let's let that dry for a little bit longer. We can take the tape off carefully so that's a year of protection. Choose one of our kits to match the condition on, of your lights and your preference if you want to work by hand or drill. And if you got any questions, give us a call. Comment, DM, or call us. We're happy to help. Um, we'll see you next time.